JJ, I think he's already sleeping very soundly, and nothing will stop him from sleeping tonight. Yes, I think you're right, but it's our job to check on them. But I think he'll be fine tonight. Let's move on. I think our next client is James. Is that the seller in the market? What kind of sleep problems can he have? He didn't seem to be doing anything wrong. As you can see, he's sleeping too, and he's not feeling bad at all. Yes, but we were told that he has problems. And you know that if we were told that they have problems, then that person will definitely come to them at night. We need to get ready for Cat. Let's go to our base and take the whole set to protect our customers. If you say that, then I still have no choice but to listen to you and do as you say. I really like this stage when we start preparing people for their good sleep. Take all the cameras and we need to put it all inside the house so that we have control over them all day, from morning to night. Great, then let's start right now. We don't have much time. Did you hear that? I said it very well. <laughs> JJ, we did everything as you said. It's still night outside, don't you think? Is that ghost coming for them or not? It doesn't matter if it comes or not. It's our job to make sure that this ghost doesn't bother X at night. Moreover, we were told that it is very important. The main thing is that all cameras work because you gave us very bad cameras last time and they were buggy from time to time. He's fine so far, but the detector says something's wrong here. Hmm? What about this one? Why are the detectors screaming that something is wrong here? Everything seems to be fine here. Not a single ghost is visible. But why is this so? Mikey, any idea what it might be? It seems there is something, but is it ha? Huh? What kind of monster is this? What a horror. I have not seen such monsters come. Mikey, check out the ghost library. I have never seen such a monster at all. Something is wrong here. Write to our boss and send him a photo of this video. It's urgent. Am I afraid that it can kill someone? I sent it right away. But what should we do? He's already so close. He's definitely going to do something now. I'm worried about our client too, huh? What is he doing? Did he notice the camera? He has such a scary look. I'm shivering now. Where did you run off to? Is it really to James? Come on, try to do something. We need to record how you do it to start acting. What is he even doing? I don't believe he noticed our camera again. Whoa! Are you kidding me? Where did you run to? Mikey, it seems we shouldn't wait for the boss's response. We need to do something ourselves. Let's open the chest and take on an emergency set against the monsters. Let's go check on those people right now. I really wanted to try on this costume. I already like it so much. Now we are fully prepared to kill any monster we see along the way. Mm-hmm. Just be careful. We don't know what this monster is capable of. If you suddenly notice him, then immediately shout to me about it. One on one, we may be weaker, but two against him, we will definitely be able to defeat him. Huh? I don't think that monster did anything. Because there's nothing wrong with this guy. He didn't even move because of that monster. I think we should move on. Yes, but that monster wouldn't have had time to do anything. He noticed the camera and ran away somewhere. But what worries me is that he noticed our cameras. Usually ghosts don't have to notice it, but the monster did. Are the cameras okay? And this guy too. This is all very strange. Let's go back to the base. Let's think about what we're going to do. I don't know. I sent a message, but the boss hasn't answered anything yet. Mm -hmm. Are we going to wait for him to answer or what? Uh. I think I won't sleep tonight anyway. You can spend the whole night thinking about it all. I still get the shivers from that monster's gaze. Mm -hmm. Good morning, Mikey. Wake up and sing. The boss replied to us and he sent us something. Do you want to know what? Then wake up and let's check this chest. Of course I want to find out, but my eyes are still closing. I want to sleep. Come on, hurry up. All right, these are the spikes. What do you think? The boss told us to close this village. He knows something about this monster, and he said that the monster will not be able to escape from the village if these things are standing. So let's spend the whole day putting it all around the village. But we don't have much, so we need to figure out how to make it as long as possible. It's so easy. Just put it down, and then if we don't have enough, 
Ask for more of the same pieces. It's not a problem for the boss to get us protective equipment. All right. We did a good job today. We spent a lot of time putting all these things on. But I'm happy that we did it. Although I'm still afraid that the boss knows something, but hasn't told us what exactly. <laughs> Let's wait for the night! Here we are, sitting in front of the TV again. So I think it's time for us to start our work. The sunset has already passed, and we can start. Mikey, sit down next to me and start watching what's on our cameras. We did not put additional cameras in vain. Now we have an overview of the whole village. Mm -hmm. huh? huh? Here he is again, but what does he want to do? Does he want to come to us? Come on, try it. You're not going to make it anyway. Huh? Where are you going? JJ, turn the camera on John. I think he will come to him again. He told me that he had a headache last night. This is a very bad sign. Hmm? I told you he would go to him. And now I think we can go right there and right now before he runs away. Let him think that the camera is looking at him and will come to him in the meantime. Good. I see that you've read something about him. Do you really know something? Great. Then I'm coming for you. JJ, it's quieter now. He can hear us and he's running somewhere again. Everyone, the sleep gods have come. Hmm? Is he not here? It's very strange. We've just seen this monster. John is fine. John is fine? But then why did this monster come? Maybe he has some kind of lair here? This should be an obvious place. I don't believe he could have run far. Hmm? Mikey, could that monster have been hiding in that well? Let's try to check it out. JJ, then let's go there in the morning when he gets weaker. In the meantime, we'll go back to the base and get a good night's sleep. The monster won't run away anyway. All right. Now that we know everything about this monster, we can go right now. Now that our boss said that that person could hide there, it gives us an advantage because that person definitely doesn't expect what we know about him. We need to get down somehow. I think we could grave the water and go down. Good. Then turn off the water flow, and when the water goes down enough, we can jump in there. That monster definitely didn't get stronger, did it? Because he was so intensely passionate. JJ, get ready! We're going to jump in there! The water is almost at the bottom. Hey! hey. Oh. Whoa. Mikey, he's here! This monster was really hiding here. Shoot him! Do you think we can scare the crap out of us? You almost did it! But we were stronger! Mikey, don't stop firing! Sheesh! We did it! I'm so glad about it. I thought we were going to die. It was lucky that he was alone. What kind of lair is this? It seems he wanted to catch those people and keep them here. It turned out to be a pretty smart monster, but we were just stronger. JJ, bad news! It seems he managed to catch someone. But the main thing is that we were able to stop him before he did more. We have a very scary job. What a strange dream I had! I should wash my face and walk around the village to forget about all this. Where did I get that computer at home? I don't remember buying anything like this. It seems to me that I really need to take a walk and remember everything. I'm going to go so crazy! Mikey, what are you doing there? Why didn't you invite me to go for a walk with you? JJ, are you here? I just wanted to do something! Look at this! How do you like that? That's what you deserve! Please don't bother me anymore! I don't want to go out with you, you're kind of stupid! He probably didn't sleep well last night. What should I do? Hmm? What is this thing? I've seen this in fear movies. I wonder if it still works or not anymore. It seems like it was used to execute bad people. What if I stick my head in here? Does it work? Hmm? What happens if I try to do this? Hmm? It doesn't seem to have worked. <gasps> Why is it so easy for me? My head doesn't hurt anymore. And it seems that I can't feel my mouth or nose. What's wrong with my head? Where is she lying? Did I just chop off my own head? What an idiot you are. JJ, how could you do that? What a horror! It looks like a horror movie! I'm a walking corpse without a head now. Am I even a ghost? What should I do now? How do I tell others that I'm a ghost now? Hmm? 
Or maybe not to tell them about it. What if I try to prank Mikey? I think he's definitely going to be scared of this. Mm-hmm. Everything is ready to scare Mikey. It seems he's already gone out there somewhere. Where is he going? I'll probably follow him into the mine. He probably doesn't see me anyway. Although no, he has to see me now. Hey Mikey, where are you going? Don't you want to say hello to me? Or have you already forgotten about me? What? What do you want? I'm not going to say hello to you. Get out of here, you stupid piece of idiot. So you decided like this. Well, I didn't force you to say it. But soon you'll regret everything you said to me. Where are you going? To the mine? Do you want to get something there? Well, let's see how you do it. It seems there is some kind of stove here to melt the ore. How lucky I am. We need to get a lot of iron and coal today. Haha, <laughs> you want to get a lot of ore? Well, let's try it. Stay where you are. Now I want to show you a new me. Hey, Mikey, why didn't you say hello to me? Look what happened to me because of you. It's all because of you. <laughs> it turned out to be a great joke. I wonder what you're thinking now that you've seen me, hmm? I can't believe my eyes. Was it JJ? But why was he without a head? Maybe it's not him, but it was his voice. And why did he decide to come here? Maybe I should leave early today. Although I have to work a lot of hours today. Okay, I have to forget about it. <laughs> why didn't you want to talk to me? Look what happened because of you. I just wanted to take a walk. No, this is all not true. I don't believe it's you, JJ. Don't come near me. I do not know what you are talking about. Is he really gone? After all, I just imagined it all. I'm going further into the mine. I haven't started work yet and I already want to go home. What nonsense. All right, now let's see what you say now. Mikey, why do you need this job? It would be better if you stayed at home and didn't go out today. Listen to the advice from your friend. Leave me alone. I know that you are just my imagination and nothing more. Don't make me think that you're real. I know what's wrong. I'll dig better and I'll forget about you and you'll be lost. Okay, let's see what you're going to do. Are you really going to keep digging for ore? You're a strange man. How many more times do I have to scare you? Wow, I found a mob spawner. How lucky I am. There are still a lot of chests. Huh? <laughs> Mikey, I'm telling you again. You don't have to do all this. Just go home and bury me in a good way. This will be the best thing to do all day. I'm going to see where you died there. I don't believe they cut off your head. It's just terrible. It seems that this is the place where the head was cut before. What a stupid place. You couldn't just die there. I don't believe in all this. I'd better go to the bank and take the money from there in order to repair the house. Are you kidding? What should I do to make you believe me? Okay, I need to get the money from the bank before he does that. Repairs can wait. Hi, man. I want to exchange the ore I dug up in the mine for dollars. How do I do this? You won't do that. I'll take all the money and you won't be able to exchange it. Can I go up and pick it up already? Let's see how you do it. The money's on the second floor. Is the money in the safe? Hmm? <laughs> what happened? It's strange. Hey, man. There doesn't seem to be anything in the safe. Are you sure there was money in there? I'm sure of it. Can we look at it again? Huh? What is it? Ah! What do you want from me? Can't I just take money from the bank and renovate my house? How you're pissing me off already. Don't come near me at all, please. I can't do this. You're not doing what I'm asking you to do. You are to blame for all this. When will you understand all this? Just start doing what I'm asking and I'll leave you alone. Or you can die. Huh? Is this really a joke? Some kind of joke? He's just mocking me. I'd better go to the mine and earn more money to buy something for myself or for JJ's house. There's still so much to dig up. I hope he won't bother me here. You must be really dumb. How many times have I told you to do this, but you asked for it? Mikey, get out of here. <laughs> Don't dig a mine today. You could die from this. I'm warning you for the last time. If I just don't look at you, you'll disappear. Disappeared? It worked. Well, then that's great. I'd better go home and do something very important. Will I at least be able to sit quietly He's finally there? gone home. Now let's see what you can do. I don't believe it's just a ghost. I'll close all the doors and windows and he won't be able to come to my house. And this means that I will be able to get enough sleep today before tomorrow. No one will enter through these windows and doors. And now that I've closed it all, I can go upstairs to the attic and finally get some sleep. I'm so tired today. I'm just terribly tired.
Now it's time to scare you completely. I hope you're home. Hmm? Did you close the house? Really? That scared? It seems you've closed all the windows and doors with wooden sticks. Are you kidding me? I'll have to break it all or blow it up. Well, all right. Then you'll get what you wanted. I'll blow up all your windows and doors. Then I'll be at your house. All right. Now I'm waiting for it all to explode. Sheesh. And how long before this one explodes? Hey, hey. And now I'm going to break all your wooden sticks. Although, why am I doing this? You can then escape through these holes, but where are you sitting? Maybe under the stairs. Hello? Where are you? Why aren't you here? It's strange. Maybe you're sitting on the second floor. Precisely. You have a proper bed there. Mm hmm? And you're not here either? You're kidding me. How could you close the house and get out of here? There's something wrong here. But what exactly? I need to figure this out. 